Hi everyone, I hope everyone is well. So we're here at Plaza Inversa in the south of Mexico City at the headquarters of Inversa, a huge bank in Mexico owned by Carlos Slim and Telmex. Telmex. So today we're going to be looking at five different Mexican companies ending in Mex. I can't think of too many countries which play with the name of their country so much with their companies. Now I'm putting this in an order from five to one. So number five, we have Telmex. Telmex is the largest telecommunications company in all of Latin America. One of the biggest in the world and owned by Carlos Slim, one of the richest men in the world. So we're actually in his compound. It's called Plaza Inversa. It's a proper kind of billionaire's playground. We have the Telmex building, as you saw over here. And over here you have the Inversa headquarters. This is the bank of Carlos Slim. And I say it's a playground because it has things like towers. But most impressively, by far, is farm animals. There you go. And they also have birds in this little area. But, oh, they're having a bit of a... Are they fighting or is it something else? For Mexican people, it's, I don't know, probably 90% likely if you have broadband in your house, it's going to come from Telmex. There's something very Transformers-esque about the Telmex logo. Can you see that? And here is a Telmex telephone. Well, actually, there isn't a Telmex telephone. So this is probably a good reflection of the, the telephone industry on the streets with everyone having mobile phones. The ironic thing is, I was just saying how the telephones are disappearing, but this corner and a lot of corners in Mexico City, you do see so many telephone boxes. So there's one, and right next to it, there's two, different company, three, four, and that's not enough, no. Of course it's not enough. There's another two here. And at number four, we have Banamex. Banamex is one of the largest bank brands in Mexico. Banamex is actually owned by Citigroup, the large American bank conglomerate. Now I'm outside a Sumesa supermarket here. They have a Banamex ATM, a cajero, and I'm looking for a Chicharito poster. Usually he's advertising them all over the place, but I don't seem to see him anywhere anymore. It is owned by Citigroup, but Banamex really is, I think, a Mexican brand. It was formed by, I believe, two Mexican banks merging, and obviously Citigroup got their hands on it, as they do with many banks around the world when they expand. And at number three is the king of dogs. Obviously not, it's Pemex. I actually filmed this during the day, but there was a problem with the file, so I had to come back. Pemex is fully owned by the Mexican government, so it's just basically it's a state-owned oil company. And Pemex, up until recently, has had a complete monopoly over, for example, gas stations. So in Mexico, whenever you go to a gas station, it's always a Pemex. You do not find Shell, you do not find BP, you do not find anything, it's just Pemex. But with the new reforms in the petroleum sector, in the next few years, we will be seeing new gas stations from other brands. So just to emphasize the point that Pemex is are everywhere, over here is a another Pemex behind these beautiful trees. And at number two, we have Cinemex. You can see the popcorn over here. If you're not from Mexico, you might find this incredible. I certainly did. This is salsa picante. So this is hot sauce. And what's it for? Of course, it's for the popcorn. So when you go to the cinema in Mexico, the usual deal is you get your popcorn, then you come over here, and you put salsa over your popcorn. And the number one is Humex. So Humex produces juices. Humex are based, I believe, just outside of Estado de Mexico, and they have a museum as well. But something which I find quite distressing right now is my favorite drink, the piña colada Humex. 
nowhere has it. I've been into a 7-Eleven, a Circle K, and no one has the Jumex Pina Colada anymore. Okay, found a nice place to sit here. And if you're interested in tango, Jueves de Tango at this place. Personally, I'm rubbish at dancing. I'll quite freely admit that. I ended up buying this Humex, the Manzana. I really like these Humexes. If you come into Mexico and you have a choice between Del Valle or Humex, go for a Humex. If anything, it's worth, worth it just buying it just to take the top off. When you take this top off, it's great. There's like a sound and you can see the cold vapor you know moving upwards i'm going to head out now if you like this video please do give us a like a thumbs up that helps the channel spread and if you have any comments that would be great perhaps you can suggest more companies ending in mechs and if you're a new subscriber welcome to the channel and if you haven't subscribed yet more videos are coming soon hasta luego